Hello everyone, welcome to High School Mathematics channel. Today we are going to learn Class 6, Chapter 2, Whole Numbers, Exercise 2.1. See the first question. How many whole numbers are there in between 27 and 46? I have written numbers from 27 to 46. Let us count the numbers. How many are there in between them? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So 27 to 46 in between there are 18 whole numbers. See another method. From 46 you subtract 27 we get answer 19. But here our question is between numbers of 27 and 46. So we subtract one number from this. So 19 minus 1 we get 18. Therefore there are 18 whole numbers in between 27 and 46. See the second question now. Find the following using number line. 6 plus 7 plus 7. We shall count 6 plus 7, 13. 13 plus 7 equals to 20. So 6 plus 7 plus 7 answer is 20. Now let us show this on the number line. First we have to show 6. 0 onwards you mark 6. Then 7 we must add. Count 7 numbers after 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 6 onwards you mark it on 13. Next we must add 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 13 onwards you mark it at 20. 6 plus 7 plus 7 that equals to answer is 20. See the second question. 18 minus 9. That equals to 9. Now show this on the number line. Mark 0 onwards 18. Now from 18 backward count 9 numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So 18 onwards you mark on 9. Therefore 18 minus 9 we get answer 9. See now second question third one. 5 into 3 equals to 15. That means 5 times we have to show 3 on the number line. So let us show this. First we have to show 3 numbers. 0 onwards 3. Again 3 numbers that is 6. Again 3 numbers that is 9. Again 3 numbers that is 12. Again 3 numbers that is 15. So 5 times we have marked 3 on the number line. 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3. That means we get answer 15. See now third question. In each pair state which whole number on the number line is on the right side of the other number. If we observe on the number line, left side onwards towards right, lower to higher numbers will be there. That means larger number will be on the right side. See now first sum. 895, 239. Which number will be on the right side? 895 is on the right side of 239. See second one, 1001 and 10001. 10001 is on the right side of 1001. See third one, 15678 and 4013. 15678 is on the right side of 4000. 13. See now fourth question. Mark the smallest whole number on the number line. On the number line observe which is the smallest one? 0. So we are going to mark 0 on the number line. Therefore 0 is the smallest whole number on the number line. Today we have seen chapter 2 whole numbers exercise 2.1 1 to 4 sums. Hope you all like this video. If you like this video please like share to your friends and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.